In this video, I'm going to demonstrate using a loop. And the type of loop that we have access to is a while loop. And so a while loop goes as long as a condition is true. Now, if we want to do something a certain number of times, we have to create our own counters. And that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to declare a variable that is a counter. And I'm just going to say it's a counter. And it's of type int. And I'm going to have a max, so the quantity that I really want to do. So I'll have another variable at quantity. And it's also an int. And then before I start my while, I'm going to set the value of the counter equal to 0. And I'm going to set the value of quantity to, and by the way, you can you can set a value when you define a variable. So I'll do that here to 12. And now I'm going to loop while counter is less than quantity. And that's going to be my loop. Now I'm going to do a couple things in here. So I'm going to use a begin and end statement. And then inside here I can choose the things that I'm going to do. So I'm going to simply print and let's do the counter is and let's just record the value of it and print it out. Now this is a number so we have to cast it as a varchar and then I need to increment the counter. This is actually a big deal. If you forget to do this, you get an infinite loop and you can do that. Real easy to get an infinite loop here. So we want counter to equal counter plus one. All right, and that'll increment our counter. Oh, we have to set it. You always have to use the keyword set to give a variable a value. All right, let's go ahead and run it and see what we get. And there we have a loop that happened 12 times from 0 to 11. Now this is a 0 based counter. If you want it to be a 1 based counter, you just put 1. And then here you put less than or equal to and run it. And you get 1 through 12. Either case, you get a loop that happens exactly 12 times.